why I think keeping and collecting is real important. And of course we do something which is akin, but not quite the same as a museum might do. These are caricatures. So we're preserving. I see it as a, as a kind of preservation. And when we sell something to someone, in most cases I think they understand that they're protecting a piece of culture, they're protecting a piece of history, the history of a people. And I think they really, really appreciate it that way. Maybe it's important because I really am a teacher, and that's real important to me. I think if you've got something in your house, I think it's kind of important to know where it came from, and who, who enjoyed it, and who made it, and so forth, yeah. They're a shield which is either made out of rhinoceros or out of hippopotamus, and that's very, very thick leather. And there's only one of these, you know, that's another thing that's fun. You know, there's no factory line production. So it's all handmade. And it's amazing what people can make just using their minds. What's inspirational is the fact that this is material that's made in many cases by societies that are very simple and not very technical. And yet the work can be beautiful and very sophisticated. So I think we make a mistake when we think of people being primitive because there's no such thing really as primitive people. There's people who live in little societies and then there's places like ours which is exceeding complex. And that variety I think is wonderful.